uh, we have in within our group uh, experts who are working in the basic research lab and taking that to the clinical arena looking at cerebral blood flow velocity and cerebral autoregulation regulating the pressure and the amount of blood going to the brain not just the amount of oxygen going to the brain but the pressure at which that oxygen is delivered to Ken Brady and Dr. Blaine Easley. They are doing these studies in the lab and they are developing monitors that not only look at cerebral oxygenation but they're looking at cerebral blood flow velocity and cerebral uh, perfusion pressure. This is a translational laboratory and what we work on is uh, developing uh, translational models that are physiologically comparable to the patients that we take care of that have critical heart, lung, and cardiovascular disease. Our particular focus with the series of uh, experiments that we've been working on uh, here at Texas Children's Hospital is looking at cerebral vascular autoregulation. And what that is, is we are looking to see if we can monitor and guide our blood pressure management in our models, but also at the patient's bedside, so we can understand how best to provide blood flow to the brain to try to minimize periods where there's not enough blood flow and the brain can become injured. Our focus over the last year has really been on trying to understand better how well the brain is getting blood flow during cardiopulmonary bypass. And so children that have uh, congenital heart disease and need to have uh, corrective surgery uh, require uh, being placed on cardiopulmonary bypass or a heart-lung machine. And we know that there's somewhere between 30 to 70 percent, depending on the study you look at, can develop new lesions in the brain that we see with brain imaging. We don't know if that really translates into a neurologic injury, but we do know that children can have more neurodevelopmental issues later on in life. And so if there's anything we can do to minimize those changes during the time of the bypass procedure, then that's the focus.